So we get this question a lot about what is osteopathy and how do we define it. To define it to a patient, a person that's seeking out osteopathy for care, I would say that osteopathy is a form of science that requires an art of touch. So it's both an art and a science. Okay? The art of it is that a person learns how to feel the tissue on a patient and figure out whether it's moving or it isn't moving properly. The science comes from the background of learning the, the technicalities that we use to describe these things to each other, the, the anatomies and the physiologies, that sort of thing. From a patient point of view, an osteopath learns the body from head to toe. We learn about organs and organ position, we learn about circulation to those organs and how that relates back to things like drainage and proper nutrition and that sort of thing. We learn how function of muscles, we learn how to, the joints move, we learn how the joints don't move and when they don't move what happens to them. We learn about things like tendons and meniscus and we learn about headaches and we talk about neck pain and back problems and functions of those areas of the body. We deal with mechanics of the foot and proper, you know, proper footwear and how that can wear on somebody's body and cause a problem for them. We uh, deal with, with um, degradatory problems, things like arthritis and we deal with and we teach a full pathology to all of our students so that students are very aware of how to adapt their treatment plan for people with different types of pathologies. So really everybody can benefit from osteopathy, it just depends on how much and where in their body they'll benefit from it. For more information on this or other subjects, please visit our website at collegesofosteopathy.com.